So we're on the road to creating everything and anything in our slow cooker. Today that road continues with these super easy, macro-friendly Sloppy Joes. So let's just jump right into it. Start by heating up around a tablespoon of olive oil on medium heat in a pan on your stovetop. Once that heats up a bit, you're gonna add in one chopped up green bell pepper, one chopped up red bell pepper, half a chopped up onion, two teaspoons of minced garlic. You can choose to add in other vegetables if you want here, but this is usually my go-to for this recipe. Go ahead and let those cook for a couple minutes. After that, add in two pounds of lean ground beef or turkey and cook that until brown. Make sure to break it up while doing this. Quick note here is if you use a lean enough meat, you won't need to drain it, but if there's a lot of liquid left over from using a fattier meat, you'll probably want to drain it a bit. Once that's cooked, take out your slow cooker, optionally add in a liner to it and add that mix in. By the way, I link my liners below in the description in case you wanted to check them out. Next, add in one can of a low sodium tomato sauce, one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce, half a teaspoon onion powder, half a teaspoon of garlic seasoning, fourth a cup ketchup, four tablespoons of a tomato paste, two tablespoons of honey, two teaspoons of mustard, a little black pepper, and a little salt. Mix all of those ingredients together until it looks like this, then throw your lid on, let it cook on low for four hours. Couple tips here. You don't want to pre-cook your meat and vegetables. You can just throw everything in your slow cooker, cook it on low for around seven to eight hours. Just make sure to break your meat up. Obviously, when you think of a sloppy joe, you think of a nice big bun, but really, this mixture you can eat with anything. Use low carb wraps, make lettuce sloppy joes, add in more vegetables, or just eat it by itself. It's that good. And last, I usually portion this out into eight servings, as you can see on the screen right now. With that, thank you guys for watching another Slow Cooker Sunday recipe. Don't forget to tag me at The Protein Chef. Use the hashtag Slow Cooker Sunday so I can feature you. Check out Labrata Nutrition and my website that has a ton more info on it down below in the description. Smack that thumbs up button if you like this Slow Cooker recipe. Subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on notifications so you never miss a video. And of course, stay healthy. Also, I want to start releasing some new content in the same format as Slow Cooker Sunday. Maybe a one minute Monday or two minute Tuesday type deal. Is there any type of content you guys want to see on this channel that you haven't seen already? Maybe some quick all around tips? Let me know what you think. 